Hey guys, Fair Strike here. Hey guys, Fair Strike here, and I'm back with another video. It's been a while since I made a video because I went on vacation and I I just took more time than I wanted to kind of just take some time off. But I'm back again and I'm ready to make more videos. Uh, starting with this uh, how to strip your minis videos video and uh, as you can see here there's an orc or orc uh, and I'm not really gonna zoom because I have gloves on but you can see orc here so how to strip your minis I've been uh, please excuse the outside noise I'm recording this outside right now but so how to strip your minis. If you have a bunch of minis that you want to repaint for whatever reason, if you have to buy up some detergent or s disinfectant. And I bought some Dettol, which is kind of like a brownish liquid. And I soak this overnight, soaking your minis overnight. And I have a brush to brush it, some extra water to get off the flakes, a cloth. And yeah, just some newspaper so it doesn't get on the ground. So I'm going to show you one right here. So I wonder if I can zoom in right now. So I'm going to just zoom in the camera. There you go. See if that's good. Yeah, you can see it. So this war boss here, I'm going to kind of clean up. And it's been like, what, five years since I painted all these guys, these war boys. Orox now they're called and I want to I'm doing this because I want to convert them into orc boys for the 40k universe so you can see there the colors coming off it works really effectively and of course GW, GW doesn't want you to know about this or maybe not I don't know and I really liked this paint scheme for these guys excuse the sounds again but and yet again, I feel like I need to get some orc boys for my 40k army, so instead of spending tons of money on orc boys, I just put my 60, see it came off, 60 orcs from the Age of Sigmar universe, and yeah, so laundry gloves are good, or dishwashing gloves are good, so you don't get this stuff on your skin. A brush is good to brush. I have to buy another toothbrush now because I don't have any. And water to dip it in. And yeah, you just leave it overnight. Pretty much, I soaked it in this tub here. Can you guys see that? I think it's still zoomed in, right? So, yeah. Anyways, that's my video. I will put the product in the description below what it, what it is. And I'm just going to start to continue brushing these guys. It's some work, but I think it will pay off in the end. I also have some Gretchen in here. So I didn't put much of a coat in here, but and they're coming out the base. So some of the parts will come unglued, but mo for the most part they stay kind of, you know, together. So anyways, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one. More content coming up.